Greetings everybody, this is Domingo with you today. Hope you're doing fantastic. I got a request from a subscriber on how to use Rumble for your desktop. Now, you can check the Rumble for mobile device on the description below, so that way you can download the app, and also it's available on iOS now. So here is the Rumble on the desktop site, or on PC or Mac. So you go to rumble.com, and it takes you to this page. So it shows you the Rumble logo, the three lines here, give you latest editor picks, trending, licensed videos, and then it shows the featured channels here. So there's a lot of channels that are featured on Rumble here. And you can decide to watch those if you like. So when we click on that there, it goes straight to the home page, and then it shows here battle leaderboard, and then some of these have over 16,000 rumbles, 15,000 rumbles, and this is the main one where you can earn at least $24 on this one. That's quite a bit of money. And then there's about 7,000 views, and this was made just two days ago. And the channel is called Deer in Nature. And then as you look here, it shows news, viral videos, podcasts, and then there's other categories like science, editor picks, sports, and then video player, video exchange, and video hosting. So you can choose to integrate a custom video player for free storage and encoding, video exchange for frictionless licensing, and then video hosting, manage and monetize your videos, industry high CPMs, mobile applications, DRM control, white and black listing, full transparency, and easy syndication and distribution. So I'm not going to explain all this. This is up to you to figure out. So if you want to go and click on each of these to learn more, then you can do that. And then it shows community, developers, our team, our apps, about us, and the store, and then all your disclaimer information down here. So then what you do is you go to sign in, and then you can create a Rumble account, sign in, or sign in with Facebook, which I'm going to do right now. And then it's just going to use my Facebook credentials, and then it's just going to load, and there I am. So I haven't logged on to Rumble in a while, so I have about 316 Rumbles total. And then when you click on your profile, you can show account overview. And then this gives you an overview of your information on Rumble. So I only have $15.50 to cash out. But you can only cash up to $50, as you can see. I explained that on my last video, and that is still what they have. And then you can look at your stacks and analytics, options, verification, transactions, payments, and then also your referrals. And then for your video section, you can go to auto syndication, all videos, schedule videos, monetize videos, my licenses, policy violations. And then you can go to my subscriptions, create a channel, and my channels. And then for publishers, you can upgrade to a publisher account, player integration, ad integrations, data usage, OTT and MRSS feeds, and then widgets and scripts. Now this is new, so I won't be doing this yet because I'm still on YouTube and I'm still monetizing from YouTube, so I might try this later on there. And if you choose to upgrade to a publisher account, I think there's a lot more features. So then you go to videos, and then you can also go to channels to search for a channel. So let's say you wanted to search for Alex Jones. I'm just using that as a name. And there's, okay, there's three channels. Alex Jones, Infowars, Alex Jones, Infowars. There's two of the Alex Jones channels, so I don't know which one's the right one. So you can go to, let's say, let's go to show, and then you can go and see the channel. And then you can subscribe to the channel, just like YouTube, and then you can look at the videos here. And then it shows all the info there. Oh, that is actually Alex Jones. Okay. Okay, so anyways, apparently he has another platform. Anyways, so we're going to go back to Rumble. And ultimately, you can go to upload your video to upload a video on Rumble. And then you can select a video to upload. And then it takes you to your folders, and you can choose which video you want. So we're going to go into Pictures. And then... For example, we're just going to choose a custom video here. And then we will just go here. I'm not going to upload any of those. And then we can choose whatever. And then let's just say webcam recording, but that's a minute 41, which we won't do. And then this is uh, my Nintendo 2DS video review. So let's just go and upload this one. 
and then we'll just see lightsaber test 2020 and then my friend as a Jedi with mad skills and then we'll just add tags Star Wars lightsaber VFX Jedi um, blue you can add whatever tags you like here and then you can upload to your channel and then once the transfer rate has already been done you can then go to upload and then you can go video management make it exclusive so you can set it to exclusive video management excluding YouTube and then rumble only not exclusive similar to YouTube and you can look up the info so it says here you're assigning exclusive rights to of your video to rumble you entitled to 90% of the advertising revenue on youtube.com and 60% of the advertising revenue on all other websites read the full terms and then this shows here you are assigning exclusive rights management to your video to rumble Inc excluding YouTube you'll be entitled to 60% of the net advertising revenue on all websites where we place your video and then Rumble only, you retain full control and rights. Rumble will be granted a non-exclusive license for the video player and provide 60% of the advertising revenue for any revenue generated within the video player. Then personal use, not monetized. You retain full control and rights. Rumble will not partake in any promotion or monetization whatsoever relating to your content. And then you can write additional information, who appears to your video, a friend, and then where, when was the video recorded, 2020, uh, November. And then you can also provide my Instagram or TikTok name. So we'll just provide my TikTok name, for example, D22Talk. You can add me on TikTok in the description below. And then also add my YouTube link. We'll just add my effects channel to it. Now, com slash D22 effects. We'll just we'll we'll just do that and see if that works. I haven't used this in a while, but then you can also add additional syndication options. So for YouTube, that's the account. Then you can set the category, made for kids, no. Then you can also turn it on for Facebook, Vimeo, Daily Motion, and Pinterest. So you can link your Pinterest account, your Vimeo account, Daily Motion, and Facebook for syndication. So you can syndicate on five different sites. So we're not going to do that. And then it says here, you have not signed an exclusive agreement. You click here if you agree to the terms and service. And then you ultimately submit, which I'm not going to do because this was just a test. So we're just going to go back. And then there we go. That is how you upload a video and set the rights exclusive to Rumble or YouTube, depending on the revenue. And to watch a video, let's just go watch a video here. So we can click on a video. And then it shows the subscribe button up here. It shows the share button here. Then it shows the name of the channel, when it was published, the amount of views, the title of the video up here, and then the revenue earned from it. And then you can also press the plus to add a rumble, and then press a minus to minus a rumble. And then you can embed it on your website, copying these links here. So monetize direct, embed in frame, and then JavaScript embeddable player. And then what we do is you can go license, so you can buy the rights to the video. So you can do single social usage and then single domain broadcast, broadcast plus single domain plus single social. So you can buy a license to use this video. So you got some pretty good leeway and control when it comes to putting your videos on Rumble. And then here's a comment. So I'm going to add good video and then you just press comment. And then it goes down here. And if you want to delete the comment, you just press delete. And then it says, are you sure you want to delete this comment? You can say yes or no, but I'll say no. So there you go. And then you can also rate the rumble. And then you can see the show low scored comment. And that's why it was rated under that because it was spam comment. And there you go. That's how you comment. So then you can delete your own comments. You can't delete other comments, but you can delete your own. And then you could also check out videos on this side here using the same thing. And then you can also share using Parler. Well, Parler's down, so it's not going to work. Reddit, WhatsApp, Twitter, and then email. Then you can also like it on Facebook. And then you can also share it via a share link. So you can share it on Facebook there. There you go. And then it loads onto your Facebook site. 
So that is the gist of how to use Rumble on the desktop. And then you can also search for videos up here. So let's say how to use Rumble. So a video like that won't appear on the Rumble page, but there is actually a tutorial from Rumble Fact. This has about 2 million views. And this was made last year, 743 Rumbles. And then this shows you how to use it. So I'm just gonna click on it. And then what I'll do is I'm going to Give it a give it a rumble. So this shows you how to present rumble, and then this doesn't give you the option to add favorites. So I think there there's a full screen function here. So this gets it to full screen, and then for this, I think this allows you to set the quality, and then you can also add up to yeah set sets the quality, and then this is the volume control. And then this is the time bar. And then you can embed it on websites here. And then you can also comment on it. So, so yeah, if you liked it, it'll show you uh, it'll show you that you probably rumbled it. So what we'll do, you can go to my content to check on your content, and then this is the videos that I've made. So I haven't uploaded a lot on here. I've only uploaded a few. And some of them have a decent amount of views, but others are just just stupid uploads. So my most viewed video has about 64 views. And like I said, I haven't uploaded a lot here, but that's okay. I've just been experimenting with this and I've had verification. I'm verified on Rumble and I can just pretty much upload whenever. But I mostly just use YouTube as my main source of content distribution. So this is another way that you can co distribute content on Rumble. And that's it. So I hope this answered your question. And if you have any other questions, leave me a comment below. And we'll see you next time for another video. Take care.